Januari mwaka 2024 ikiwa ni Jumamosi ya kwanza ya mwaka huu 2024 basi itakuwa ni Jumamosi ya kihistoria kabisa manake leo ni ile siku ambapo uh, Silas anaenda kufunganishwa ama anaenda kufunga pingu za maisha uh, na mwenzake ambaye ni Kadzo hivyo basi watakuwa wanaelekea makanisani waweze kupewa uh, ama waweze kufunganishwa kirasmi rasmi na kanisa ambalo litakuwa ni cathedral kule mjini Mombasa na hapa tulipo tuko majaoni twende eh, kanisani kule eh, cathedral SK ya Mombasa uh, ndo tukuje turudi kwende reception twende kuona mambo mengine yakiendelea kumbuka leo ndio ile siku ya harusi na kama unavyojua matukio ya harusi venye huwa yako siku zote ni kuwa uh, tunatoka nyumbani kwa bibi harusi tunampeleka bibi harusi uh, hadi kule kanisani kanisani pia wanafuatia uh, mambo ya kufunganishwa kufung, ku, kufunga kupewa pete uh, na pia tukitoka hapo watoto kwa naelekea eh, watakuwa naelekea pale katika reception ambapo hapo ndo kutakuwa na matukio yote yaliyosalia kama ni kucheza watu watacheza huko kama ni kukula watu watakula huko na bila kusahau eh, pia kutakuwa na mazawadi watu watakuwa na peana kule eh, katika uh, reception hivyo basi mtazamaji wetu Chiche TV sisi tutakuwa tunakujuza kila wakati kila tukio linalotokea kumbuka hii ni harusi ya kwanza kabisa Januari na ni harusi ya kihistoria kwa hivyo uh, ni harusi ambazo zinaleta familia mbili kwa pamoja kwa hivyo tunatarajia kuitakuwa ni harusi kubwa sana 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 kwa hivyo mtazamaji wetu Chiche TV kumbuka sisi tuko hapa kwa ajili yako kuweza kuhakikisha kuwa unafahamu kila kitu kumbuka pia bila kusahau tutakuwa tunafanya baadhi ya mahojiano na baadhi ya watu ambao watuweza kuongea nao siku ya jana maana kumbuka hapa tunaongelea kuhusu upande wa bwana harusi upande wa bibi harusi kuna watu ambao jana tukiweza kupata nafasi ya kuweza kuzungumza nao leo tutakuwa tunapata nafasi ya kuzungumza nao tuweze kuzungumza naye mawili matatu ama uh, tuweze kuongea nao waweze kutueleza wanahisi vipi na pia ushauri wao ni gani katika maharusi hao wenye wanaenda kufunganishwa leo kumbuka ni masaa machache Silas atakuwa na mke rasmi rasmi uh, Lorin uh, kijana wangu Silas Fumbi ninyi ni vijana wazuri ambao Mwenyezi Mungu amempendeza kwamba kufikia sasa mukaweze kuunganishwa kama bwana na bibi 
kama tulivyoambia mengi jana katika kuwabariki uh, nafasi nzuri ambayo Mungu amewapa na sasa tumefikilia wakati mzuri ambapo mnaenda kwanza jamii yenu uh, napenda tu kuwakumbusha kwamba ni safari nzuri iwapo mtaendelea kukubaliana kama mlivyokubaliana kwanza kukubaliana kwenu sasa kufatwe na vitendo na mtakuta hiyo itawapatia nguvu na motisha ya kuweza kukabiliana na kila changamoto ambazo mtakutana nazo katika maisha yenu changamoto ambazo mtapata katika maisha yenu ni sehemu ya process ya nini kukulia maisha ya kukua maisha mtapata changamoto kama bwana na bibi mkiwa bado hamjabarikiwa na watoto mtapata changamoto mkibarikiwa na watoto na kadri mnavyoendelea kupata umri utakuwa na changamoto kadha wa kadha lakini uwezo pia mko nao ninyi wenyewe kwamba mkaweze kukubaliana na kutatua every uh, problem has a solution so don't do the reverse that every solution to have a problem no it's every 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 problem having a having a solution kwa hivyo tunashukuru kwamba tumefika wakati mzuri wa kuwa uh, kwa miezi kadha hapo nyuma tumekuwa na changamoto za kupanga kumekuwa na matatizo hapa na pale lakini tunashukuru pia kama ninavyosema kwamba kila tatizo lina msuluhisho tumeweza kusuluhisha mengi yao you can attest to that you've seen the process you've seen the challenges na vyenye sisi kama wazazi wenu kama kuna ndugu zenu na wote wanaohusiana nanyi wamesimama imara kuhakikisha kwamba process ingeendelea mbele na kufikia sasa tuna shukuru kwa ushindi huu ambao tuko nao kwa hivyo naamini tumeongea mengi na wengine wengi pia wameongea mengi yote hayo yawekeni kama akiba ni yenu we have been, we've spoken this was specifically for you mkiatilie manani na mtakuwa wa ushindi katika maisha yenu mtakuwa pia kielelezo kwa wengine wengi muwape motisha hata vijana wengine mubarikiwe muwe na maisha mema amen asante aya my name is mbeyu sharon kudunda I am the groom sister. I'm not the groom, I'm the groom sister. <laughs> Ndio mimi hapa sasa. Uh, mimi ni team even, second last born wow and I am so 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 happy to be here today. Tunamshukuru Mungu. Naona hata kuna baraka za mvua. Uh, so ninaombea harusi njema ya kufana every good thing nikija huko ni kwani umefanya mashavu like uandali wamenye alikuwa nikikuandalia and uh, uwe ukija nyumbani usalimie uh, i wish you all the best basically na <laughs> just uko tu wewe like don't change okay maybe change for the better okay Okay, na wapenda nyote kadzo. I am so happy tumejuana tangu kitambo. Uh, I hope uh, this marriage is as good to you. Yeah, everything. Baraka za Mungu na wajalia kwenu. Mungu awabariki. Amen. Uh, hi guys. My name is Patricia. Uh, we are we are having a very beautiful day today. And um, what I can say about uh, today's date is that it's it's a very important date to Kazo and Sila. We are really happy for her. We are praying for the best for both of them. What I can say is anything is possible as long as you put God in everything that you do. Whatever you do, make sure you put God first. Marriage is not easy, but as long as you communicate, you love each other and pray and uh, never forget to pray. That's one thing I can say. Pray, pray, pray. Because that is all that you need in a marriage, in any relationship, so that it can be prosperous. For me, I'm very honored to be participating. I'm a friend to the sister-in-law, to Kazo, Sada, and I'm, I'm, I'm really glad 
that I was given the opportunity to be in this day, in Kazo's best day. I'm the matron, I'm handling the kids. I love kids. So I am um, I'm really enjoying that part of being the matron. Yeah, they make a lot of noise. But anyway, I'm enjoying and I wish the best for Kazo and Sila. May this day be a start of a very beautiful journey and may God always, always be ahead of them. Thank you. So my name is Grace Nema or, or aka Princess Nemo. I am glad that this event is here. It's my sister's wedding and I'm very happy for her. I can't wait to see her uh, getting her life up together. And I would like to tell the couples, the newly wedded, that uh, may God go before you and straighten your paths. And may you live together forever as you will be promising each other in the vows. And uh, how I pray that uh, we shall live to see you as role model couples because you're going to be strong all the way. And I'm praying to God that he can bless you so that you can be able to flourish in your love and uh, i wish you all the success and i love you more <laughs>
sana kutoka majaoni hadi kufika hapa hivi kanisa la Cathedral mjini Mombasa. Bwana hapa ndo kutakuwa kunafanyika harusi. Ile ilikuwa imekombe harusi ya Silas ambaye atakuwa anaozeshwa rasmi na kazo. Sasa hivi kiangalie katika kopo langu la saa hapa hivi ninasema sasa hivi saa saba na dakika uh, saa saba na dakika tisa hivi. Kwa hivyo kama hatujachelewa sana. Kuchelewa na tumechelewa lakini hatujachelewa sana. Hivyo basi tutakuwa tunaingia kanisani tuweze kuona nini kitakuwa kinafanyika pale ndani. Kumbuka sasa hivi tuko hapa katika msafara wa bibi harusi ili ni gari la bibi harusi. Kiangalie nyuma yangu kuna wale ma brides brides team ya bwana harusi na pia bibi harusi tayari washa kutana baada ya kukaa kwa muda mrefu sana manake eh uh, shughuli hii ilikuwa ianze mida ya saa nne lakini mpaka sasa hivi sasa saba bado ijaanza kwa hivyo uh, najua inaweza kuchukua muda mfupi sana katika hapa kanisani ndio tuweze kuelekea kule uh, piko resort kule mtu hapa tuweze kwende katika, kwende katika reception kwa hivyo mtazamaji tutakuwa tunakujuza kila wakati kumbuka hii ni chisha tv tunakujuza kila wakati
tumeta kanisa ni hapa mtana wa leo ili tukashukurie kuanishwa kwa wapendwa wetu hawa ambao wamefika na wako tayari tunapoanza ibada hii sasa kwa wapo wako wenye nasi tukubariki katika ibada hii mwisho wa ibada hii tulikuje jina lako maana tawaomba kwa jina la Yesu mwokozi wetu basi tunamuomba